Okay. Well, YouTube fans, here I am. So Emma Queen Tingling back at you. Yeah, I am the Queen Tingling. Um, I'm in my car right now, and I'm sitting down here, and uh, at the bottom of the hill from my house. There's a little convenience store where I buy my tickets. I haven't bought a ticket tonight because it's after midnight and I'm not after midnight, excuse me. It's after draw time. But uh, I came down here early. I didn't win the evening draw, but boy, was I close to it. Uh, but I hit today. I hit today and I hit last night. Um, I hit today, midday, for 7.03. I hit last night, I believe it was uh, 863, I can't remember what the number was, last night here in South Carolina. But then, also, the last time I made a video, uh, I had did the one for Virginia. And would you know, I know you're not going to believe me, but hey, you need to go back. I can't remember if it was 11th or 12th or exactly what day it was on that I did. I, sh I started to make a video right after that. But, um... I, we hit on pick four for uh, Virginia for that day. It was 15 something. Else. I can't remember the right off the top of my head. I'd have to look. I had to be at home from my computer. I'm not at home from my computer. But boy, I tell you where I am. I'm down here at this Chinese restaurant. I got hungry. And, you know, lately I really ain't been eating a whole lot. I just, this has been hot. I ain't really want nothing. But then a friend of mine told me brought me down here bought me dinner last night and you know what can I say you should get a bite once it's just not enough you just kind of keep on coming down here I didn't you know I, I didn't even think this little Chinese place was any good but hey it's the best place I've seen around here in a long time and it's just right here next door almost to, to where I live they give you egg roll with your dinner I got shrimp fried lo mein with fried rice. What time I got that last night? What was it good? Mm. I mean, I ain't even been so damn hungry all my life. I sat there. I really didn't eat a lot yesterday. I ate what I had bought down here yesterday for dinner. And then today, the only thing I've had was like a little... I ate a whole jar of... Uh, mushroom and stem pieces that's like the kind of stuff i like i'm not really too crazy about a whole lot of food those almonds oh lord hope ain't nobody hurt probably somebody got shot around here uh-oh oh look at that i ain't had nothing to eat all day i need mushroom and i don't really know what i want then i got thinking about this Shrimp fried low man, I said, damn, that was good. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. I'm telling you what's true, if I didn't have my car, I would not be down here. Now, this little old car has took me a lot of places. I'm, I'm going to take y'all through five points in just a little while. I'm going to just do that. Let y'all ride down through five points with me, see what it's like on Friday night. Five points in South Carolina and Columbia, let me tell you, it's crazy. Where USC students with Gamecocks go to party and play on Friday and Saturday night. The bar area. And a bunch of bars and restaurants and stuff down there, places to shop. Yeah. And kids get down there after 9 o'clock on Friday night and Saturday night. Man, they just had a complete fool. Mm. Get down there and they get drunk. But long about time they get so drunk that they just about pass out. They about ready to go home and can't find a way home. All kinds of bunch of crazy crap going down there. I seen one boy get hit by a car about six months ago down there. That was terrible. Him and two other guys was fighting out in the middle of the damn street. This girl was cruising through there and Boy, she came right up and popped him right in the butt. I mean, she didn't mean to. She just, you know, the bo one boy slung him out in front of the car. Well, that's what happened. I mean, he ended up going head first into the concrete. Um, 
I never did hear about him dying or anything like that, so I guess he got better. Because he, when I seen him, he hit head first into concrete and went into a seizure right off the bat. So, wasn't nothing I could do for him. I was so far away. I could see what was going on, but I was so far away from him, and then everybody else kind of crowded out around, and the police come running over there. There wasn't nothing I could really do for him at the time. I'm going to pray for him. Man. Mm. These egg rolls down here are awesome. I'm telling you what, these Chinese people that cook. Mm -mm. Hey, I don't care if they do serve me a kitty cat down here. All I got to say is if the kitty cat tastes this good, the kitty cats better run for the hills. <coughs> the old fat gets hungry. Mm-hmm. That's not so I like kitty cats. I like cats, yeah. I was just joking. Mm -hmm. I wouldn't want nobody serving me cats. Do you know one time? Um, back when I first came to living in Columbia, Lord have mercy, I can't get my drink if I hold them. When I first started living in Columbia, I was in the Vietnamese restaurant over the other side of town off of Decker Boulevard. And I had ordered me, um, what they call pho, beef pho. That's rice noodles and beef soup, and boy, it's good stuff. I'm sitting in there waiting on my food and everything, and I heard a meow. I I swear I wasn't crazy. I only heard it like one time. It was like really, really short. And then I never heard it anymore. I got thinking, I said, did I just hear a cat? Yeah. And, um, uh, I guess I ain't never been back there, but I don't know. I just don't know. These folks do know how to cook, though. Mm. Hey, this stuff is awesome. Mm hmm. Mm mm mm. Well, tell you what, let me get out of here. We're going down to five points just a little bit, right around. And I'll show y'all a little bit of five points. Anyway, like I said, it's Friday night. Anybody uh, playing midday in South Carolina, I would highly recommend 831 as a uh, midday pick. I think it might be a double. I wouldn't swear on it. But, I don't know. It's just when I sit here and look at the book and the little book that I told y'all and showed y'all, and then I look at Everything else, uh, how it compares it. The 831 is looking really, really interesting for lunchtime tomorrow. And I'm telling you, since I got that little granny book that uh, I've been telling you about, wow. I mean, I have been hitting dang near every draw. Just about every draw. I haven't really focused so much on pick four but hey I told you hit that Virginia pick four just the other day somebody had called me and I remember giving her the number uh, and talking to her I only gave her four numbers but that was one of the numbers that I gave her here's some shrimp Jump folks in there know that cook all right the granny book, like I said, is pretty much good for any state. And, um, you can try it out. It feels so good just being out of that room. But yeah, it's pretty much good for any state. So, if you're lucky enough to be around one of the, um, Indian stores where they sell those things, they don't sell them at the regular gas station. They sell them at the Indian stores, Indian convenience stores. Or you can look online. 
I forgot bring hands or something like that. Um, I had to put a link up for it for those books, but you can get like a 12 month subscription of whichever book you want. All right, out and take care of yourself. This is Betty Queen Chingling, and I'll get back with you in a couple minutes. We're going down to five points shortly here. Ciao.